Hayde. You already know the importance of wiping out your data before selling or disposing of your old computer. Deleting your files or formatting your hard drive leaves all your files on the hard disk, ready to be discovered by anyone with advanced recovery software. So if you were looking to wipe a hard disk, then you can use the D-Bind, short for Derex Boot and Nuke software. A few limitations with the D-Bind is that it does not guarantee secure wiping of solid state drives and no RAID drives. D-Bind is ideal for home users with non-solid state disk. In order to use D-Bind, you will need to create a bootable media, which can either be D-Bind, bootable USB or a CD or DVD. I suggest creating a USB since it is easier and most people have access to it. Download the Dibun from the description section of this video and after it has been downloaded, write it to a USB using Rufus. You can find the download link to Rufus at the description section of this video. Once the USB is ready, connect to it to the computer or laptop where the disk needs to be wiped. Then change the boot order from BIOS to boot from the USB. Before you start wiping out process, remember to back up all your important data. Any data on the hard drive you are going to wipe will be lost permanently. If you have more than one drive attached to your computer, it is recommended to remove all other drives except the one you wish to wipe. If you wish to automatically wipe off all this, type AutoNuke and then press enter to wipe data using a 3-pass DOD level wiping. You can press enter key to start diving in interactive mode. Once you are in interactive mode screen, select the drive you want to erase and press F10 to start wiping process. I'm not going to do that as I don't want to erase my data on the drive. Be patient, depending on the size of the hard drive, wipe process may take a long time. Once done, take the USB out and you are good to go. Dispose of your system and sell it. If you decide to reuse it, or if anyone else decides to reuse it, then they will need to reinstall operating system on it. That is it. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.